I am Melissa Lyons, and this is Sherwood Lyons. We're the grandparents of Slade Lyons, who's a fourth grader out here. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, and we're so proud of our school. We're really touched by all the support that we've received here, from Bovine especially. Uh, we never would have dreamed that... Uh, well, we would have because we lived here all our life, and the main reason we lived here because of the support and the people that live here in, in our area. And so many people everybody. have have come to the hospital, and and Showed supported. Such support. And he is taking it like a little champ. He is not worried. He said, "God's going to take care of me." And uh. And thank you for all your prayers and yeah. support because. It certainly has found its place. Yeah, Facebook has really helped a lot. They have, <laughs> uh, we have people praying all over the country, and it is absolutely wonderful. I can feel that, that everybody really cares, <laughs> and we really appreciate it. He went to the doctor in Clinton. He's had headaches for two or three weeks. Having, yeah, having headaches, and uh, they gave him some medicine for the strep, and then he kept having the headaches after he took all of his medicine. And the doctor caught something in his eyes where uh, he said, we need an MRI. Well, when he sent him to Barry Batson to get the MRI, they caught a mass. And they immediately admitted him into the hospital. And they've been running tests since Thursday. Friday, they ran tests. We thought we might have it Friday, but they, they postponed it so they would have the team. And the doctors over there are absolutely wonderful. We've gone through. They had to do uh, ear tests, eye tests, uh, hormone tests, blood tests. Uh, Endocrinologists. Yeah, just they've, they've really worked on him and they have uh, been monitoring him. The, uh, the tumor is in the middle of his brain behind the pituitary and it's in a really terrible spot as far as operation because of side effects that it could cause the, from removal. But the Dr. Where, Shiflett said he is the uh, doctor that does all of the brain tumors in Mississippi. So we know we are in good hands. And we have talked to all the other doctors and they are absolutely wonderful. So we feel like everything is gonna go well. We just have to pray that it's not, it's benign. And uh, we just have to have faith in God. We're here for the balloon release that the, that the school has put together. Yeah. Uh, Carrie Hoban has put a whole lot of things together for the family and we really appreciate her. And uh, they're going to let loose 400 balloons in, Slade, in Slade's honor, and they're all blue because that's his favorite color. And a lot of the kids have worn blue. And uh, the principal came to see him, and the, some of his teachers came to see him, and uh, he was so proud of that. He was so proud. He can't wait to get back to school. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and one of the little boys, one of the little boys shaved his head in his honor. <laughs> it was so cute. <laughs> Little Peyton. <laughs> Little Peyton Hoban. Here we go! Three! Two!